Hey guys, it's Coach Gary Salas, and I just wanted to get on really quickly and talk to you about our next gardening project. So our next gardening project, if you remember, I told you in our first video that I didn't have a watering pill. I found a way for us to be able to do this watering pill and be able to water our plants uh, in a good manner. So what we're going to be doing is you're going to need some assistance with an adult or of an adult to make this um, happen and what's going to happen or what I'm going to ask you to do with the help of an adult is we are going to puncture some holes into this milk carton top or the milk cap with a nail and we're going to do that by the use of a hammer so this is the part where I need you to ask your parent or adult That's right. excuse me to help and assist you in doing so all right so I'm going to put the phone down so that way you guys can um, hear me, but you might not be able to see exactly what's going to go on. All right. So again, you're going to need a hammer, a nail, a gallon jug, the lid to the jug, and a water hose. All right. And what we're going to be doing is we are going to put your nail on the top. And with the hammer, we are going to hammer in a little hole. Okay, so again, I'm going to put the phone down so that way I can do my first little hole and then I'll show you how we did it. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my hammer and the nail and I'm going to poke a little hole with the nail. So you should be able, when you're done hitting it, you'll be able to lift it just like that. You'll see that the nail is sitting in the top. You're going to be able to pick it up and move it around. Now, if you flip it over, you should be able to see a little piece of the nail. So you want to make sure that you make the hole big enough so where water can come out. Now I want you to take some time and make a few holes on the top of the bottle cap. Alright? So as you do yours, I'm going to do mine. Alright? And you want to make at least, make sure that it goes all the way through. Poke your nail through. You're going to have to take it out and poke it through. But you want to make at least a good five or six holes in the cap. All right. So once you've done that, you should be able to Mom. see your water spout. Um, the, bo the bottle. Yeah, the bottle has a little hole in it. Mama. Uh. Can you hold the milk carton for me now? Yes, I got it. Okay. Good. Now it doesn't really matter where you put these holes, you can arrange them however you want, okay? But it is going to help you when you go to water your plants if you've been planting with us, alright? Now I'm not going to put too many in here because I don't want you to continue to look at a black screen. So um, I put about five holes in my top and then I'm going to pick it up so that way I can go through the rest of the video with you. Alright, so if you look at my cap, you can tell that there's about five holes in it. Alright, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to get the water hose. I have the water hose ready. Noah's going to hold my jug for me. And we're going to put this water hose inside the container. Alright? So I know it sounds loud, but it just sounds like that because the water is going into an empty jug. All right, and I'm not going to fill it up all the way. I just want to make sure there's some water in there so you'll be able to see. All right, and then I'm going to get our top that we just poked the holes in, and I'm going to place it on top of the jug. All right, and now we should be able to see that there is some water coming out of our jug. All right, so hopefully this all worked out for you. Now you can use a whole gallon jug. You can use a small jug. It's all up to you. All right, and so that is our watering jug for the day and for the rest of the time that we're at home. All right, hope you guys have a great day and a great week, and we'll hope to see you guys soon. Bye.